this is me, Matt Pettifer, and this is the journal of my attempts to make a documentary. A documentary other than this one. It began with me analyzing Mexican culture in hopes of finding out what's wrong with America, and ended with my realization that I don't have three years into my researcher. Everything you will see, every conversation you will hear, while dramatized actually happened, in some form or another. There are no actors, just regular people trying to do for the camera what they did yesterday. What I want to do is sort of um, an explore, exploration. <laughs> Mexican youth culture and what differences they see in themselves. You know how in America, in high schools are supposedly really divided? Jocks, nerds, freaks, cheerleaders, druggies, whatever. What's that word? Um, people, um, they're very, if they're similar and there's not much difference. Um, homogeneous. Homogeneous? Or For my first interview, I talked to Ian's intercambia, or foreign language speaking partner. And uh, she wouldn't go on camera, but I learned a few things and he was there, so I just interviewed him about it. I guess I'll start by constructively saying that he eventually learned something. That his project was crap. After an hour or so, my minor cambio somehow figured out what he wanted to say. And she told him that Mexicans uh, in the school system, that they basically really didn't have any divisions. That his views on Mexican culture were almost as skewed as his perception of how people were in America. It was sad. Overall, it was just really, really boring. I don't know why he interviewed her. She wasn't in the age group that he wanted, and she wouldn't go on film. She's really nice, and I wish I never let him interview her. Anyways, so you want to do your movie on a breast cup now, huh, Matt? No, it's, um, you know what I'm saying, how family is really, I guess, tight here and everyone... It's just about the generation gap. If you have things that you can't really talk about or be around with your family, then there's going to cause breaks. And I guess the more time and the more things you can do with your family, the less breaks there are going to be and the closer you'll be, right? So, you mean like the less subjects that are taboo among the family, the closer, the better the family unit will be? Yeah, they'll be more comfortable with each other and they, they won't really feel the need to have to be with their friends more than family. Seriously. Yeah, but what does a breast have to do with that? Alright, that's... At this point, I decided to turn to Ian and Vanessa for help. They had found a musician they called the Zocalo Cowboy. He wandered about the square singing the same song and trying to sell his tapes to whoever he found. Ian and Vanessa sort of became obsessed with him and followed him around like he was Jack Kerouac. At one point he even made a crayon autobiography for them. He called himself Ray O. Baby and the other mariachis feared him. They would say, Él es loco. I know so it's tough work. Who is it, baby? Yeah, Vanessa. What? What? Yeah, I was gonna do my documentary on the Zocalo Cowboy for real. So, do you think you two could help me out? Um. Well. well we kind of have our own little agenda. We got our own things to do in town, man. If you didn't spend all your time in the Terranova bathroom, Matt, you would have gotten um, you know, a jump start on your documentary. 
We have better things to do with our time rather than sit on the toilet all day. We got plans. <laughs> Oaxaca, Oaxaca, el compositor oaxaqueño presente, Rey o Baby. Oaxaca, 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 tu nombre que es hermosa para no olvidar. Yeah. Oaxaca, Oaxaca, Oaxaca. Tu nombre que es hermosa para no olvidar. Yeah. Y tus hermosas zapotecas, y tus bellas mixtecas, eso sobra. Oaxaca, Oaxaca, Oaxaca Tu nombre que es hermosa para no olvidar Oaxaca, Oaxaca, Oaxaca tu nombre que es hermosa para no olvidar. Y tus hermosas zapotecas, y tus bellas mixtecas, eso sobra de caminar. Oaxaca, 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 tu lenguaje plolclore que en colores. Oaxaca, 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 tu lenguaje plolclore que en colores. Ea. Oaxaca, tus montañas y tus manantiales y tu lenguaje son tu hermosura. Me despido de ti, mi bella Oaxaca. Iré, iré. En el corazón Oaxaca, Oaxaca, Oaxaca Tu lenguaje con flores en colores Oaxaca, Oaxaca, Oaxaca tu lenguaje flores que en colores. Me despido de ti, mi bella Oaxaca. Iré, iré, iré. Iré, iré, iré. Llevándote.